Greetings, everybody. I'm actually calling upon my, you know, everyday people, uh, individuals who've watched all my videos pretty much. I need your assistance. I'm looking for a video, the one where I made the prediction how long President um, Trump was going to last in office. I actually gave the number of months. Now, do you remember? Now, I have a habit of deleting my videos just, just because and um and most of them sometimes i put on private i'm not sure i'm looking for it i'm having a hard time finding it but do you remember that video and if you do do you remember what it was titled or at least the gist of it maybe i could search by keywords or whatever but this seems the time is upon us now that video uh talked about his time uh, when it would be expired and um, I was not saying that because other folks were saying that. I saw that in a dream. I actually had the months, the number of months um, that he would be in office. If you remember, let me know. Okay? And in the comment section, talk to me. See, there's a very thin line between arrogance and confidence as far as prophetic dreams are. And so sometimes I'm really shy or weary to just come out and see it. Pretty much like the one that I posted this morning with the February 3rd, 1931. Keep that date in mind. Now, this is something that happened in the past, but I suspect about to happen again. Okay? Uh, talk to me in the comment section and tell me if you remember. You know, sort of like the time when I had a dream about Hillary Clinton having this conversation with Obama and saying certain things and I mentioned it in that video and when her book came out the exact things were there so um, I wish I could find it because I'm trying to remember I know the prediction was made but I can't remember exactly what I was saying you know or how long that video was but the time is at hand and the great Donald Trump about to face reality like we all have to we all have to face reality teaches us to be humble teaches us that when you think you are so powerful and you're so awesome that you know your day is coming your day of judgment is coming. we all have our day mm -hmm. we all have our day Never mind, don't pay attention to folks who act like they're, you know, so superior and so mighty and so powerful. Please, their day is coming, their night is coming. There are two things that are happening that confirms with me uh, that those who, <coughs> excuse me, who love to oppress others got their moment coming, their rude awakening. There are two distinct things happening um, in the spiritual and the physical realm that causes me not to be so stressed out anymore about what people are doing or how people are trying to harm other people. There are two things happening to the, uh, the, our greatest adversaries in the world. Two things that, that mark an end to their reality. Um, these two things they promote because they want other folks to be a part of them because they recognize that when they stay in that state uh it's only going to you know bring them to that place where they force other persons to be and these two distinct things uh, shows that nature doesn't operate the way you and i do and seek revenge when you and i seek revenge the, the, the nature doesn't even deal with revenge it just deals with you know, balance, equilibrium, you know, if you do, if you, this, 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 this scale is going to tip, you know, if too much weight is here, this one is going to be out of whack. Two distinct things that show there's no reason for you to exercise hate or to just be depressed or sad or just be constantly crying about what folks are doing because they their own undoing is becoming from their own mind, their own spiritual walk, the way they deal with other folks. It's just, I'm just going to keep it at that. Two distinct things um, that, you know, 
inability to multiply oneself means you die. And that inability to move from what is natural to unnatural indicates the same thing. These two distinct things tells me there's no reason for you to go around even being angry because nature has a way of sorting us out good and proper okay so don't worry about wicked and don't worry about those who constantly do the same thing and you're saying oh where is god where is the god god is in you man is inside of you and me where is god why is this happening all the time and you know, come save me and, oh man, save yourself. Understand that you have the ability to do many great things. And when folks outside of you uh, think they are harming you, they're actually harming themselves. Let's see how this one plays out. But remember, if you remember that topic, please say here, when I predicted the time that this man would last, the months, and it's right now. Stay blessed.